Hey, what's up guys, Pro here, um, I'm doing another one of my editing videos and this one's going to be uh, screen flashes that I have up in the sky that kind of flash with the beat of the song. Um, in this video I'm just going to use a 5 second clip because I want to render it and show it to you, but it takes long to render, so I'll try and get a uh, quite a short clip, if I can find it. This doesn't exist anymore, by the way. Yeah, if I just take this one, four seconds. Um, I did my own color correction into it. Just drag it into your timeline. You want to press U on the audio that comes with it and then delete. Um, I want to see what this actually looks like. That's what it looks like. This is a color correction and this flashes. So the way you do that is you get a song. So use this one again. Put it into there. Let's listen to it quick. Alright, so there, just delete that. Yours doesn't have to be here, I'm just using it for video purpose. So, once again, for this one, you're just going to click M on the beat. Okay, um, and then what you want to do is you want to click on the uh, markers you pushed with M on the keyboard, and you want to click S on all of them just to split them up. Mix all just makes into the video. Then for the first one on the uh, first beat, you want to zoom in and go to event effects. Then you want to find Sony brightness and contrast. Click add. OK. You want to move it over a little bit so you can actually see your video preview on the right. Now um, you want to click the time animate on all of them and drag it up to what you feel looks good so. it's kind of flashing the screen that and then once you've done what you've done here on the first light you just adjusted it how you want it and stuff you can then go on to this little thingy here drag it to the end and double right click on all of these to restore them then you want to close that and you want to right click copy click the next one go to the end of the last one hold shift and then click where you want it to stop you want to right click paste event attributes and then that's it that's basically it so if I just read this up it shouldn't be too long and then just render. Let's import render. Oh, this is going rather slow. Screen flashes and documents and render. I am. Um, also, go check out my clan's channel. Uh, we're doing pretty good. 700 subscribers. It's a good clan. Lots of good episodes and sizzle going on there. I'm bringing it on now. 
Alright, what do you want to do? Just type in Dream Research. Here is the. It's a pretty good clan. Oh, it's done. Alright, now if we open it, it might freeze for a start. If it does, I'll play it again. And as you see, the screen sort of, the light around there flashes, look. So that's how you do your um, screen flashes. If you want me to help you with anything, uh, send me a message and I'll be bringing more tutorials so you know also request what you kind of want in your um, in the description and I'll put that in there because my leader does request quite a lot of stuff and uh, half of the stuff I do is on After Effects as well so please uh, request stuff I hope you uh, like this video I hope this helped and um, I will see you in the next video Thanks for watching and uh, bye.